I'm Stuart Blower, stone carver. People ask me, why do I carve stone? It's heavy, uh, it takes a lot of work, uh, you need a lot of tools. I use a lot of air powered tools, a lot of electric uh, diamond bladed tools. So what's the point? Well, I guess the point is that for me, it's uh, a completely different thing from my regular commercial business, which is photography. I, I still like the, uh, the 3D aspect. I like to capture stuff and document it as a photographer, but I needed a different release. I needed something that was a walk away step away from photography. I still do commercial work. I still do a little bit of fine art photography, but for me, the distinction for stone carving is a much more relaxing endeavor for me. I can look at stone, I wait till I see something in the stone, and then I try and make that happen. So sometimes you set projects that you know are going to be a challenge. And, and that's, that's part of it. The part of it is to uh, relax, concentrate on something totally different, organize something totally different. And the creative aspect comes in when you find that image and you release it from the stone. So you look at it for a while or you work with it for a while and it starts to come to life. And then depending how hard the stone is to work with, that's where you either work with heavier tools or in some cases invent different procedures that will get the job done. But it's that aspect of taking something hard and immovable and heavy and bending it to my will, bending it to my, my creative will. It lets me put energy into it and I get images out of it. So that's why my, my creative process can span photography, but it also spans stone carving. And for me, there's a much more creative release at the stone carving end.